This is my response to the Light Up the Darkness um, video that was sent to me by Luciana. Um, it, it really uh, I touched my heart because there is so much that we can do and um, I, I do want to let you uh, hear a passage that um, is in the Old Testament of the Bible, um, but it, it relates so close to this that I just really like to read it. And then, you know, if you don't want to listen, that's fine, but it's, it's the same concept and the same thing that we're trying to do here. Um, it's from Isaiah 58, starts at verse 8, and it says, Then your light shall break forth like the morning, your healing shall spring forth speedily, and your righteousness shall go before you. The glory of the Lord shall be your rear guard. Then you shall call, and the Lord will answer. And you shall cry, and he will say, Here I am. If you take away the yoke in your midst, and your pointing finger, and speak, and speaking of wickedness, if you extend your soul to the hungry, and satisfy that afflicted soul, then your light shall dawn in the darkness, and your darkness shall be as noonday. I just, it just hit me. I heard that quote on the other video and this verse came to mind and we have been told for centuries and centuries to light up the darkness to to do what we can to show love to others and you know despite the evil and the bad things that happen good's always eventually going to outwin the evil and we just have to remember that we may lose a few battles, but we will not win lose the big war. So, um, thank you so much for posting, and um, I hope that we hear lots of responses from people who are willing to let their light shine. Bye, guys.